Yeah, we were parked in Fresno for the Central Section Championships. Coach Eloy Quintana from Madera South High School. Team ran very well today, 26 points, just under 79 minutes team time. You mentioned you felt this was probably the best race of the year for you guys. Elaborate a little bit more. Uh, yeah, it's the best race of the season so far, and I mean, it's and it's the right time to run the best race of the season so far. Of course, with the state next week, but along the way, we've you know early on in the season, things were not clicking all the way like they should. Our results were not as fast as they should, and um, you know, just, we made some adjustments as a coaching staff, and as we were patient, and as the year went by, we started to actually show our true our true capability, especially for example, at Rough Rider Invitational. We came out, ran really well there, and then we just kept on training and kept on, you know, just our head, you know, focused ahead on the Valley meet and obviously the state meet. So for us to do what we did today was really great and really special. Very good. Obviously, this is a state qualifier here. We've got a bit of a nickname for you. Oh, God. Uh, <laughs> my nickname for you is a human caution tape. And the reason I say that, the last two years, I always hear from other coaches, other teams in September and October, what's wrong with Madera South? What's wrong with Madera South? If there's any little thing, I know you hold kids out. You're overly cautious. That's why I call you human caution tape. But the kids are always ready to run at the end of the season. They showed it last year. They're showing it this year. You know, they ran well at Rough Rider, but ran well week after that, and then now today. What's the team's psyche like going into the end of the season right now? They're, they're, they're doing really well mentally. And, you know, they were looking for that race though to confirm that things are ready to go, and today was it. And they feel like we have a great chance to rate, you know, to do something special next week, you know, against great competition. I mean, goodness gracious, it's California. It's the, one of the best states in the nation in cross country. You got great programs. You got to show respect to Great Oak, defending champions. Dana Hill's tradition a great program. Obviously, I believe you have Roosevelt out there. Uh... New rankings are out. Number one is Great Oak. Number two is Dana. Number three is the tie between Madera South and Bellarmine. Oh, okay, uh, Bellarmine Prep. Yeah. yeah, Bellarmine Prep up, yeah. They, they ran were, really well last they, week. They did, yeah, I agree with you. And uh, they're well coached. They're well prepared always. So it's going to be a dog fight. I mean, it's anyone's, anyone's that wants it at the end of the day. Um, obviously, what we did today was great, but it doesn't mean too It can give you a clue what might happen next week, but nothing yet set in stone. So it just means that we're on the right track. And, you know, it's funny you just say Mr. Cautious or, you know, the nickname is a lot of people think I like to play mind games. Yeah. And it's not even that. It's just us trying to make sure our team is ready to go at the right. Right, moment. right. No, I've, I've seen a lot of times when a kid is, is, is beat up somewhere, the coach will put him out there on the line and sometimes it, it backfires. You yeah. tend to be very, very cautious. Uh, like I said, the kids put it together at just the right time, so it's always very good to see. What do you think is probably the best thing you guys have going, going for yourselves going into the statement? Our pack, our pack, one pack. Through, yeah, one through five or one through six, even whatever you know we did today. I can't remember correctly, but we were, I think, at one point we were 90 seconds spread. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, that was that was a little. I was losing my hair over that. <laughs> spread, but now we're we're coming back together where we need to be, and that should help us out greatly next week. At the front of the pack, your junior Miguel Villar, he uh, ran very well today. Uh, you know, another Valley champion from Madera South. Talk a little bit about, about his race today. He ran how he's supposed to run, mentally tough. He's a tough kid. He, this whole season is, you know, hey, Miguel, are you going to get a Valley, Valley title for yourself? No, we're going to get a Valley right. title. He's that kind of kid. It's about us. Not a, you know, it's not about me, he says. But as a head coach, I feel really happy for him. He's well-deserved of this title. There's no right. one more deserving than him because mm -hmm. of all the sacrifices he's made. And the leadership he shows and the captain leadership that he has, it's just amazing. And for him to do this today, really special. Yeah, talking with him after his race, he's very self-effacing, very much all about team and talking about his teammates. Uh, great kid. Oh. So you guys are in a great situation. Good, uh, congratulations on the about today and good luck at State. Thank you. Appreciate it.